A former Texas Tech student accused of killing a campus police officer finally about to face trial. I'm Lauren Motter. I'm Brian Mudd. Prosecutors say Hollis Daniels shot Texas Tech police officer Floyd East Jr. And Daniels has been in jail waiting for trial since 2017. KMX Ryan Chandler joins us live from the Lubbock County Courthouse with the latest developments. Well, that's right. We spoke with the judge who has been overseeing this long legal process, and he tells us that Daniels will start trial on Monday after five years of waiting in jail. You may remember it was almost five years ago to the day. It was October 9th, 2017, when Texas Tech police officer Floyd East Jr. was shot and killed. It was 19-year-old Texas Tech freshman Daniel Hollis who was arrested that day for drug possession. After he was taken in for booking, though, inside the Texas Tech Police Department, Officer East removed Hollis's handcuffs as he completed that paperwork. That's when prosecutors say that Hollis had a stolen handgun on him and fatally shot Officer East, stole his body camera, and ran. He was on the run for about an hour and a half until he was eventually caught on Texas Tech's campus just outside the Citibank Coliseum with a loaded 45 caliber pistol. So after this long five year process, the court will finally get to work on some procedural items on Monday and then they'll get into jury selection. But that alone could take several weeks. The judge presiding over all of this state district judge Trey McClendon, the third will also need to decide whether this case can be held here in Lubbock County. It may need to be held at a different venue outside the county, though. So if he is convicted, Hollis Daniels faces at least life in prison. Our district attorney, though, is pursuing the death penalty. So we'll keep you updated on the latest as this case finally goes to trial. From the Lubbock County Courthouse, I'm Ryan Chandler.